Hey guys, this is Scott Leroy, Scott Leroy Marketing, coming in for a weekly tip. All right, and today's tip is on an update on the command site. So if you're running into this glitch, here's a workaround of how you can actually save a page on your agent website. So if I want to create a page on the agent website, I'm going to go to consumer like I normally do, and I'll click on create a new site at the top right up here. And then I'll click on on my agent site so I can actually create that new page. All right, so I'm just going to make a, a quick one on here. So if I use the contact form, for instance, just say I'm making a contact page, I'll leave this as is. If I click on save changes, this will pop up like it normally does for us to save it. If we click on yes on here, all right, then this may pop up saying this page is asking you to confirm that you want to leave. Data you have entered may not be saved. So if I click on leave page, all right, then it's actually going to take me away from this page and it won't save anything. All right, so that way if I go under my actual agent site pages, that is missing. Now, it looks like there may be a glitch going on right now, but if you need to add inside pages immediately before this is updated, if I click on Create Page and I go to Contact Form instead, all right, and I'm going to go to Save Changes. If you click on No, so it says, would you like to continue to site and settings to publish your page? If I click on No, that's going to take us away and it'll actually save that page for us to use. So as you can see, now this has been updated. So if I go over to site and app settings and I go to my site pages, all right, I can add inside that new page immediately. So it looks like it's just a minor glitch right now, but if you do need to add inside pages right away, this will help out to get everything added in immediately. So there you go. So that is your KW command tip for the day.